Hey, I'm here with Eliza Dushku and Tomo Penniket from uh, Dollhouse. How are you two doing today? Good. Fine, thank you. Uh, to begin, can you guys tell us a little bit about the show, kind of the premise, and you know what characters you guys play? Yes, uh, Dollhouse is about a group of people who are very human and can be can have their personalities wiped clean and be imprinted uh, to be anything that we're hired to be anyone we're hired to be. Um, so we, you know, are, it's sort of alias-like, but we're not, we're not spies. We believe we're these people, and so we're these, they call it, we call them actives, but we're mm -hmm. dolls that can be, you know, dolls for hire. Yeah. And uh, the can, ultimate fantasy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us about uh, the character you play, Tom? Yeah, I play uh, Paul Ballard. Mm -hmm. I'm an FBI field agent, and uh, I'm given the case of the dollhouse, mm -hmm. and uh, so, I'm on in pursuit of it and trying to uncover it, and I'm not having an easy go at it at all. Yeah. It's, uh, I'm running into roadblocks uh, all over the place, and it's obvious to Paul right off the bat that uh, some very, very powerful people, um, big money, whether it be government, mm -hmm. uh, politicians, CEOs, whatever it is, like a lot of people with a lot of influence, are preventing me from uh, from exposing it. Uh, Dollhouse is a is a Joss Whedon show, and you know everyone knows Joss and. It feels like a Joss Whedon show to the viewer. Um, do you guys, I mean, Liza, you've worked with him before, obviously. Did it feel like you were right back on, you know, on the bike with, with Joss there? Was it, was it similar to your previous experiences? Uh, yeah, but I mean, I think also appropriately different, you yeah. know, and um, we, we have a, a great long friendship and, and um, he knows me like yeah. on a deeper level than most people and, mm -hmm. and he really kind of wanted to create sort of more um, yeah. scenarios for me than you know he ever has and that I bet that I've ever mm -hmm. been given the opportunity to to be a part of and that was just really exciting yeah you know Tomo you uh, you know you haven't been on Josh show before really but uh, you were on Battlestar which is kind of similar in terms of like the, the cult kind of status mm -hmm. uh, what have the similarities been like in terms of Battlestar going to dollhouse well I mean similarities obvious ones uh, you know like we had Ron Moore at the helm of yeah. Battlestar and it's very, very talented and respected man in, in this business. And uh, just, I think, the quality of the product already, the storyline. I mean, Joss is known for his storyline, his character yeah. development. I mean, he's considered one of the best and brightest in the business. And I was expecting that when I came into this new show. And that's exactly what we're getting already. Yeah, nice. Yeah, there have been, uh, there have been a couple of, like production issues and, you know, you move back to January from fall. Um, are you guys pretty antsy just to get the show out there and get people, people watching? I'm excited about it. Yeah, yeah. I'm ready for yeah. it to just come out. I'm just ready for it to be on, you know, yeah. and yeah. all the talk and all mm -hmm. the, you know, people's predictions and, and crazy ideas. I mean, we have our show and we know what we have and it's time to share. Yeah, that's always something to look forward to. You mm -hmm. know, so, I mean, the speculation is done and now it's up to the audience gods. Let's see what they say. I mean, there's a lot of eager fans out there who are dying to see this show and I think, uh, I think they're going to be happy. All right. Thanks, you guys. Hey, thank you. Thank Appreciate you. It.